Whether you've just started playing Beat Saber or you're just looking to get better at your new favorite addiction, I've got you covered with a few tips. Going all the way from easy to expert plus. Now I want to preface this video by saying I'm no Beat Saber god, and Expert Plus is still pretty difficult for me. What you're seeing now is probably a close estimate to where I stand, but maybe not because I haven't played Beat Saber in a little while and this is fresh footage. With that being said, let's move on to the top 5 ways to get better at Beat Saber. Beat Saber gives you a few different options when it comes to honing your craft, and the first one we'll be talking about is of course, the campaign. The campaign has you starting on easy levels, where the only goal is passing them. As you progress more and more in the campaign, you'll notice that you'll start to get harder and harder challenges. Things like setting a high score, or getting to a certain combo. Challenges give you a better understanding of the game. For example, a really big part of Beat Saber is speed. And the game tries to teach you to be faster with your wrists by failing you if you move your arms too much. Overall, the campaign is a good way to start playing Beat Saber and to get your grips on the game, but once you start getting to the harder levels, I'm not sure it'll be so useful. If you're looking to top your high scores every time you play and get to higher and higher difficulties, then warming up is something that is very necessary when playing Beat Saber. You start with the songs that you know, and the songs that are slightly easy for you, to the songs that are more difficult for you, and finally the ones that you haven't even thought about attempting yet. You'll find that this makes getting back into Beat Saber a little bit easier, because instead of starting out with the levels that were challenging you before and not being able to do them at all, you start with the levels that are easy for you and then you move on to the harder and harder ones. Modifiers are probably the best way to progress to new difficulties within the game. If you're currently able to play hard songs but expert songs are just a bit too challenging, use the faster song modifier on hard songs you already know until you feel really comfortable with that and then move on to expert. This will really soften the blow that is going from hard to expert. This one is for if you find yourself doing really well in a song and then all of a sudden there's a set of blocks with movements that seem completely foreign to you. Go into the tutor menu and select the part of the song that is giving you the real trouble, then slow it down and try to complete it that way, slowly getting faster and faster until you reach your normal speed. User generated songs are a mixed bag. They could be really really good or really really bad, but a lot of the time these songs are a mix of difficulties and speed. One song could be really simple but really fast, or it could be really slow but packed to the brim with notes. This variety will help train you to handle anything that is thrown at you. Last but not least is playing the game. The more you play the game, the more patterns you will discover, along with a variety of different movements that are possible. Patterns are a huge part of the game, and if you know them, it makes predicting directions a breeze. One last thing I want to mention is really getting into the beat of the song that you're playing. If your body is moving in the beat of the music, you'll find that it's a lot easier to hit your notes on time. And when you're going for high scores, that's half the battle. Well that concludes my top 5 ways to get better at Beat Saber. I hope this video helped you in some way, and if it did, leave a like below and don't forget to subscribe. If you'd like to, you could check out my channel and see some of my other content, but for now, peace out.